Crypto is what's going on in the tech world right now, and what do you get when you combine it with another thriving sector? A new place that gets super popular within no time. What's the other sector that we're talking about? Gaming! Gaming itself is a pretty big industry, and the aftermath of putting it together with crypto, which is NFT games, the aftermath is huge. There are free games to earn games out there, now where you can earn $200 simply by playing some games. Isn't that awesome? So which are those games? Number 1. Pegaxi. Pegaxi or Pegasus Galaxy is futuristic mythological horse racing game. The gameplay allows players to participate in the races and win the reward. The in-game horses are called Pega, which you have to select at the beginning. Once you've selected the Pega, you must pay a gas fee to lodge your intent to enter a race on the blockchain. You're then pitted against other players with a Pega of a similar class until 12 racers are stationed. Earning is quite straightforward, you win a race and depending on the difficulty level, you earn rewards. You can even rent your Pega to scholars and earn passively. It is free to start and depending on how many Pega you rent or race, you can earn around $100 a day. Number 2. Sandbox Talking about free-to-play games and Sandbox wouldn't come up? How could that be? Sandbox was built as an Ethereum-based open-world game and can be compared to games like Roblox or Minecraft. How to make money from Sandbox? The platforms offer the tools to create and animate objects and subsequently sell them on marketplaces for the in-game currency. Sand. Additionally, users can create and play custom games on the platform. You can also buy a piece of digital real estate in the sandbox metaverse called Land and populate it with games and assets to build unique experiences and then sell it for a good price. Well, Snoop Dogg has lands in sandbox, so you can already guess the price of land tokens. Number 3. HeroFi HeroFi is a blockchain-based mobile RPG that utilizes the Binance Smart Chain with its NFT assets and cryptocurrencies. The game revolves around heroes fighting in different game modes to earn in-game rewards. These heroes can be normal heroes or Genesis heroes. Both types of heroes have their own unique traits, abilities and fighting abilities. There are different types of game modes, tower mode, campaign mode and arena mode. Being a free-to-play game, of course, you can start without any investment, but if you want, you can strengthen your chances. There are three tokens, HFI, the rewarding in-game currency, Rofi, the governance token, and Hero Egg, to hatch an egg to earn Genesis heroes only. Good video? Why don't you hit that subscribe button and turn into a crypto giga chad? <laughs> Number 4. League of Ancients Does the name sound a bit familiar? Well, this MOBA NFT game follows a similar format to the very popular League of Legends and Dota 2. This game focuses on free-to-play and play-to-earn mechanics. Ten players will be thrust into the game's ancient realm tileset map, where they will battle in a 5v5 player versus player team. The map is divided into two sides, the Luminous and the Dark Souls. The objective of the game is to destroy the base of the opposing team. With B2E mechanics embedded in the game, gamers are able to earn LOA tokens by winning battles in the game. There are three game modes, normal match for beginners, NFT match, a competitive game mode, and lastly tournaments. The MOBA community is eagerly waiting for this game. Number 5. Cryo War Cryo War is a multiplayer PvP arena NFT game. Built on the Solana blockchain using Unreal Engine 4, Cryo War is a real-time game where players engage in a fierce battle in a sci-fi medieval game world. It's a battle of skills where players are in a constant battle for resources, territories and world domination. Cryo War links traditional gaming experience to best practices of the blockchain world, DAO voting, NFT and DeFi. This game integrates staking with gameplay, allowing RPG stakers to earn better rewards through increasing their in-game skill and experience levels. Sea War is the native utility token of the gaming ecosystem, which you will earn as a reward and you can use to trade NFTs in the marketplace. So which game is most likely to get into your daily routine? My suggestion would be to play all of them, if possible, to maximize your rewards. Why is the metaverse the future of work? Tap on the tab on your screen to know more about it, and we'll see you inside the metaverse.